Another module that we have available for our customers is our fully integrated vehicle health check system and video element. Having a fully integrated vehicle health checking system will mean that data can be passed from the DMS to the VHC and back again without any need for any rekeying. From this screen, we can see the headers and any associated checks assigned to that header. From here, technicians can go round the vehicle, simply marking red, amber or green against any of the assigned checks. On the wheels and tyre section, technicians are able to mark whether the tyre is visibly OK, but then also record the pressures, tyre tread depths and also the make, size, ratio, rim and rating of that particular tyre. With regards to tyres, you can set thresholds in the background of the system, so if the tyre tread depth is below the recommended limit, it will automatically change from green to amber and amber to red if required. Simply demonstrated here. As you can see from this screen, that has now been marked as amber in our checks. Once all the checks have been completed against the header, you will see that the progress bar at the top has now filled and is fully completed. The technician can then move on to the next header and work against the associated checks. In this one, I'm going to indicate a red against the glass and mirrors, at which point the technician can very quickly tick one of the pre-configured comments within the system. They also have the option to type a note or comment at the top of the screen as well. From here, if required, we can actually take a photo or a video of this element by using the media options in the top right hand corner. At this stage, once all the checks have been completed, technicians have a couple of different options. They can record a global video where they can walk around the vehicle, talking to the client, highlighting any problems or issues that they maybe need to be aware of. They can also update some information on this particular vehicle, so they can update the mileage at this point and also the spare tyre type, if it's a tyre, if it's a space saver or sealant, so if it's a sealant you can update the date on there. Once completed, the technician hits finish, which will now pop up on the service and parts advisor screen to identify the vehicle health check has now been completed and there might be some elements to be actioned. Once the technician has completed the vehicle health check, the after sales team will then be able to action any points that are required. They will simply get a pop up or every time they enter the job sheet section, they will get the pop up also. On this pop-up, they'll be able to see basic vehicle information along with the current vehicle health check status. This pop-up can be allocated to any particular members of staff, whether they are service or parts or even both. Once the user has double clicked on any necessary vehicle health check, they'll be able to see any items that have been identified as either amber or red. From here, users will be able to simply drop any necessary points down and be able to see what was wrong with that particular element. Another benefit of having a fully integrated vehicle health check system means that once the technician has selected something on their tablet, there can be a pre-configured comment stroke description populated within the DMS so the front end users do not have to populate this every time. From here, members of staff are able to price up the work, adding the relevant labour and parts that are required. In relation to tyres, you get the option to add a budget, mid-range or premium tyre to this job to then be able to send to the customer. If there's multiple tyres that have been identified as amber or red, you can simply copy to all and it would price all the tyres up at that same price. Once finished, you'll be able to see the total cost of each individual element, but also broken down into labour and part cost also. At the bottom, it will add up all the lines in terms of part cost, labour cost, total cost and total duration of the job if they were to have all elements upsold. Once this has been completed, users are able to indicate whether the labour has been fully costed and if the parts have also been done too.
once identified, it will then turn that particular element from amber to green. At this point, you can now send the vehicle health check to the client for them to authorise any necessary work.